Okay, we got the net volleyball net set up. Ambry said she wanted it up. So we got that going. And the sun's shining, you just can't see it. <laughs> just because you can't see it doesn't mean it's not there. <laughs> How do you like that? But it's warmer here than it is in St. George. What do you think of that? It's 65 degrees. It is so nice out here today. And uh, Clayton, hi, Mar, hello. And we'll probably get a little bit of rain out here. Oh, it's actually raining a little bit. So I'll come inside <laughs> so I don't get rained on. It's just so pretty out there. And <laughs> Andrea, hi. We'll let that door stay open a little bit. Clayton, hi, what's up? Not much. <laughs> Um, we'll see uh, how the how the live goes today and I'm starting early because Davey's bringing little Frankie over for me to watch him and I was going to do the live with Frankie but he gets a little crazy so I thought I'll do it before he gets here <laughs> Michelle hi yes I'm early again so when Davey gets here I'll have to Say goodbyes, but we got a got a little bit of time. Mar, if the sun wasn't shining behind the clouds, it would be dark. Yes, it would. <laughs> Thanks, Mar. Oh my goodness. Kate, hi. Linda, hi. There you are. <laughs> Hope all is well with you. I just got your pop up. Good. <laughs> Monica, hello, Rose. Hello, Mama O from Germany. That is so nice. Mar, your hair looks super. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, just swoop it on. This quick hairdo, swoop it on the side. Thank you. That's nice of you to say. I thought I got a hustle. I had to get my exercising done and uh, get, get my lipstick on. <laughs> oh, dear. And I just want to show you how pretty it is out there. It's, it's, the sun's not shining, but it is really nice. The weather is really nice. Uh, Jennifer, hi, from Union, Oregon. Wow, that's nice. I bet the, you got sunshine there. Moyan, hi, Mama Omar. Yes, the, Frankie gets a little crazy when the camera's on him. He goes crazy. I, I think, thinking it'd be fun to have a conversation with, with you all with him, but he'll just go crazy. <laughs> he thinks it's performance time. <laughs> Mar, yes, he gets a little crazy. And um yeah, Davy's coming today and then uh we got um oh activity days. We're gonna make cookies and let them decorate it. They're learning about jobs. So we're gonna teach him how to decorate stuff. Jennifer, hi, um oh Mar, yes, Frankie gets a little crazy, Linda. I got a message on my YouTube about being a moderator for your live. Oh, really? I will have to read what they say later after your live. Yeah, we got we got to have somebody that can tell the trolls adios. Adios and tell them they're not welcome here. I don't know why they are interested here. Um you're ready again today. Yes, says Moyan. And Amy, hi, Mar. The ice cream quote was wild. I know Frankie's so funny. He go what he said that uh, ice cream is be at the end of the day, <laughs> best at the end of the day. <laughs> I thought that's so cute. Then when I put the camera on him, wanted him to say it, he started goofing off and stuff. Uh, Monica, I saw I saw Sheffer Frank today cooking. It is so sweet to watch him. Isn't he cute? <laughs> he gets his little hat on. And he'll, uh, he might help me make the cookies today for the activity days to decorate. And I'll video him on my camera. Linda, what kind of cookies are you going to make? I'm going to make peanut butter cookies with the Hershey's Kissies on top and then sugar cookies and let, let them decorate them. And so that they can make them their own style. You'll be great at it, Linda. Thanks, Mar. Yeah, we gotta have somebody with the wrench. <laughs> I had my Tillamook ice cream last night. Oh, Tillamook's the best. That's in Oregon. This is where they make that. I would go and visit and watch, uh, watch. When my son was living there, we'd go and watch them make ice cream there. 
Moyan says hi, hi Mar. Mar says hello, Moyan. <laughs> Linda says yummy. Monica, yes, please let him help you. Yeah, I think I'll put him to work and and have him help with the making the cookies. Maybe let him decorate one for him himself if he wants. And Michelle, Frankie loves to cook. He sure does, isn't he cute? I know Zaid was like that when he was smaller, younger. He liked to cook, but it's cute how. They have the YouTube channel that they can uh, put his little chef, chefer hat on there. <laughs> it's so cute. Linda, hi, Mar. We'll try and do my best for Mama o LOL. Yeah, try the best. It seems like we don't have them trolling uh, in during the morning hours because maybe they're still in school. I mean, who has time to, to be a troll? Um, yeah, so... We're going to be doing that, and then I was going to go watch Sierra's play tonight, but I've got activity days, and Frankie's coming over, and I was going to have activity days yesterday, but I went and watched Taylor play soccer, so I had to scooch everything back a day, and I'll go watch Sierra tomorrow, so that will be fun. She's so excited about her play. She's in a play called The Grunch. And I'm going to show you this mama kitty. She never comes in. She's wild. But look at her sitting here. <clears throat> she's come, come right into the house. And she will let me touch her head, but that's it. She'll let me do that. She will not let me pick her up. And it's funny that she comes in. She usually sits right there. But she came inside. <laughs> Usually she would come in when Papa O was here. I wonder if he's here somewhere. And she's excited to see him. <laughs> she has cat animals can see him from the other side. Um they're all okay, Linda, they are all sleeping after trolling other people's lives, yeah. That's true. <laughs> and Mar, that's that's a good point about them being in school. Yeah, that's my guess. I'm not sure, sure on that though. But um, uh, Ab Abdul, I I like you. Beautiful. I love you. Oh wow, from Indonesia. <laughs> wow. Michelle, are you going to watch Alice play? I want to try and catch her. But boy, it, the schedule is so so crazy, and I, I'm going to try and catch at least one of her games. Thanks for asking. Hi, Kitty. Take care of Mama O oh, for us YouTubers. Yeah, she's just hanging out in here, Kitty, just hanging around. <laughs> she likes to go under my foot. See, she'll let me. She'll go under my foot, but she won't let me do the petting. So it's kind of funny, and um. Uh, yeah, so tomorrow I'll go watch Sierra's play in The Grunch, and she gets to do a, like a 30-second solo, so she's pretty excited about that. Amy, I am leaving on the 4th for Bahamas. Wow, I hope it is warmer there than here. It's been cold. I My guess is it will be really nice in the Bahamas. Haley, hi, I haven't seen you for a while. And uh, Linda, you look great today. Well, thank you. That's so nice of you to say. Linda, I had a half a day of school today. Also, you're home now. Just a half a day of school. Yeah, I like having this, this door open when the weather's nice. Now, see now Kitty's sitting over there. She kind of guards things, watching over. Happy I made Yeah, so I'm glad you made it too, Haley. Yeah, you haven't, haven't been around for a while. <laughs> and... Um, Oh, kitty, she's in here pestering. But it's nice because you can hear the birds singing and stuff. And um, the other day I was sitting out in the hammock just enjoying that. But um, Davey used the hammock ropes to hang the volleyball net up because the ropes came through. And then I had to rehang them. Uh, Mar Sierra's <clears throat> niche isn't sports. It's perform. Yeah, she does not like sports. She'll play soccer. But as soon as somebody bumps into her or uh, kicks her kicks her shins or something, she's she just says, "Take me out. I don't like that." <laughs> she loves to perform. You you see her do it on the camera. She'll pull faces and 
She loves that. Uh, Linda, you don't have to pay me either for saying it. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't even cost to <laughs> say it. Haley, it's because it's report card conference for parents. I think um, Daisy said in Mapleton they, they don't have a school today either. Or that was yesterday or something. Adul, and you, uh, Ad Abdul, and you, Grandma, happy birthday from Indonesia, Belle, like you. Thank you, <laughs> Haley. And yes, I know I've been busy lately. I just actually made it on to my volleyball team. Plus, I do uh, Krakowaki, Polish dance. Wow, that's a... That's a mouthful. That Those Polish dances are so fun to watch. And I'm glad you made it on the volleyball team. That is awesome. Yeah, the, I don't know how to say that, Krokwanaki, Kwakanaki uh, Polish dance. If Papa was here, he'd know how to pronounce that because he's he knows languages. I'm not too good at that. <laughs> Marsha, hey, Mama. Oh, hi. Just seen your live, and I just got on. I... Uh, I quit. I quit what I was. Oh, I quit what I was doing, and I am watching you now. There, there you go. <laughs> quit what you're doing. Watch you. Davy's on his way over with Frankie, so that's why I came early, <clears throat> early today. Because once cra once Frankie gets here, it's gonna be crazy. <laughs> so, so we're doing our live before I set my alarm when I know Davy will be here. <laughs> Amar, that's awesome, Haley. Yeah, way to go, Haley. Um, and Sammy, hi, glad you made it. Uh, Chakonaki, is that how you say it? Chakova, Chakovikanki, I'm murdering it. Sammy saying hi. <laughs> Michelle, schools around in my area have half a day tomorrow and then spring break next week. That's right. Spring break is next week. We're almost done with March. Can you believe that? That is crazy. Moyan, Monica. Hi, German. It's, oh, hi. In German, it is Krak, Krak <laughs> In English, we try to make some of the letters silent, I guess. And in other languages, you use, you say the word, you say the letters. Maybe that's why I'm struggling. Linda, I also just finished my good morning greeting to you. Oh, thank you before you came on to Mar. Hey there from, uh, hey there, Sammy. And Sammy says, hi, Haley. Thank you, Mar. I like how you guys communicate with each other. Uh, Linda, thanks for the heads up on your live. You're welcome. <clears throat> uh, Sandy, you look pretty. Day. Well, thank you. I think it too. I <clears throat> fixing to head out for a doctor appointment. We hate doctor's appointments, don't we? But they are necessary. Croc, croc, as in Crocs. <laughs> okay, Crocs. Thanks. That that helps me a lot. Okay. And Haley, oh Bart, Van Vanaki, Vanaki, Crocs, Vanaki. Okay, thank you. Maybe that's how to say it. Crocs, Vanaki. Uh, we're almost to Easter. I know. Can you believe that? It is. It's crazy how fast time is going. Sammy, I, I visited my aunt in the hospital. Oh, good. I bet that made her very happy. Haley, yep. Krakenok is, is in Polish one two. Is is in Polish one two. Sammy, love you. Thank you. Love you too, Sammy. And um, <clears throat> I have to go back to how you so, Crocs Vanaki. Crocs Vanaki. I'm probably still not saying it right. <laughs> but it's so nice to have winter on its way out. We're still getting some rain, but we need it. We're out here in the desert. And Linda says, good luck at the doctors, Sandy. Yeah, the doctors are necessary, but you always hope it's good news and that they'll just tell you an easy fix for whatever's ailing you. Um... Added, Adawa, hello, first time here. Where are you from? Uh, I was born and raised here in Utah. Where are you from? And Haley Krakowayaki. Did I say that right? <laughs> Did, I, I, I don't know if there's any hope for me on getting that right. 
Mar, did you get your broken tooth fixed? Can't figure out how, if you, how you break a tooth. Yeah, it's one that he tried to fill. I had a hole in it and, and a piece of the tooth broke off and he just filed it down and he said, we can file it down and I'm just gonna kick the can down the road further and eventually I may have to have a post put in, an implant or something. And I think, yeah, I'll wait till the whole tooth cracks off. <laughs> So it doesn't hurt and I, I could just wait. Sammy Mama O from U Utah, Lehigh, Utah. I was born in Highland and I live um, in Salt Lake now. Haley, I wish there was a way to say it. <laughs> I know, I wish you could tell me how to say it. I'm probably still not saying it right. Monica, Haley, yes, I know it from TV. Oh, maybe I can wa have um, uh, Alexa, tell me how to say it, the Polish dancing. And Ezekiel, say hi. Uh, Kaylee Betters, uh, are you saying it better? Sammy, what is your DIY tomorrow? What is my DIY? I, I put out quite a few of them and then I, I get them ahead of time. <clears throat> um, I'll, I'll try and remember what it is. I saw... Oh, it's, I know what it is. It's the oatmeal, no-bake oatmeal bars that I made for Daisy and Zaid for Sunday dinner instead of a cake. And they got gobbled right up. They were so good. No-bake oatmeal bars. And they were just really good. And I used um, almond butter instead of peanut butter in it for those that have allergies. Because we got allergies in the family. Um, Moyan, I saw a news the other day. The dead birds were falling mysteriously from the sky. It's trees in Utah. What? I got to look that one up. That's kind of scary. Ooh. Haley, Krakowiecki. <laughs> <Vainki. laughs> uh, Lainey, hello. Good to see you. Haven't been on socials for a while. You do look pretty. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. You know how to make me feel good. And I don't even have to pay you, as Linda would say. Uh, Monica, is is this Krokovanaki a dance? Yes, it's it's a Polish dance or uh, some kind of dance, Poland. And I'm, I'm not saying it right. I'm mur murdering it, the word. Um, I don't like Dennis at all. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We shouldn't complain because I said, well, what did what did people do before we had dentists? He said they'd give them a shot of whiskey and just yank the tooth out. <laughs> and I go, oh, that's why they were toothless a lot in the olden days. So I am grateful for dentists and that we get a shot and they can make things look so nice in our mouth and we're not running around toothless. <laughs> so that's a good part. Haley, oh yeah. <laughs> Emily, um, how old are you? I am 68 years old. <laughs> and Sammy, oh, you knew my age. Wow, Sammy, impressed. Emily, oh, okay, Sammy, I think. You're, you're right, Sammy. Linda, the cookies you're making today, isn't that one of your DIYs? Just guessing. Yes, it is. The sugar cookies, and you put uh, yogurt in them, and it makes them nice and soft. The girls will love that. Haley, or starch like or search the pronunciation up. Yeah, I'll search the pronunciation. Um, this is how you spell it. Krokonaki, Krokonaki. <laughs> I'm still murdering it. Moyan, they said in the news that it was in Eagle Mountain. Not sure how, how true that is. Well, they had, at Eagle Mountain, they had the, all those tumbleweeds in there making a, a big bonfire to burn all those tumbleweeds that were, uh, just running just all over the place you'll have to look and see all those tumbleweeds two of my kids live out there you do always look so pretty wow thank you or should i say beautiful and happy roseanne ever thanks you guys so nice of you monica oh that i didn't know <clears throat> uh, with the tumbleweeds and gta fun katie seven years older than me yeah, we all get up there eventually, but my my real age is 51. That you can have a test to see what your real age is, what you what your body is, not your your earth years. <clears throat> I mean birth years. 
but I'm at my real age is actually 51. It had me had me tested for that. And um, how many years since Papo died? It'll be three in June. And Linda, I thought it sounded familiar. <clears throat> Mar, back in the old West days, the barber was the dentist. <laughs> oh dear. That's, that's why the pole was red. Oh my goodness, can you imagine? Get a haircut and a tooth pulled all in one sitting. Mar, you're asking again, Sammy. Sammy, well, I don't know. Yeah, write it down, I guess. Yeah, it's it's hard to believe it'll be three years in, um, in June. And then I'm going to go to Papa O's grave when I get around to it, and I want to put Easter stuff up. I'm going to put an egg and a Easter bunny up. I've already got the St. Patty's Day stuff up, but I'll go to the grave and put that up. And I've, I've told you guys before I don't like going to the grave because I don't think Papa O's there. He's with me a lot, and I, I fill him in the car with me. On all the driving that I do with the uh, grandkids sports, I do a lot of driving, and Papa O's rides with me in the car. So that's why I don't like to go to the grave, but I do like decorating it. And so I'll just decorate it and leave. Uh, so I'm there about a minute. Um, Linda, say hi to Chef for Frank <clears throat> and Davey for me. I will when they get come over and bring Frankie over. <laughs> and GTA says hello. Yeah, it. <laughs> yeah, Frankie is. I don't know. He's probably going to grow up to be quite the comedian. He's just do, does the funniest things. And look how he does with Shepherd Frank, how cute he is, how well he performs for the camera. He's, it's, he's just cute. Uh, Linda Papa O oh, will, will love them. And you know, I will be there with you in spirit too. Thank you. Yeah, he'll love it. And, and I, I like to go decorate it uh, because it's just too sad to see it not decorated. It just, you know, breaks my heart. That, and I live less than a mile uh, it's not that far away. It's just down the road. So it's not hard for me to get there. I just have to do it. And it's nice that Linda will be there in spirit too. Monica, oh my goodness, I wouldn't go to to a barber dentist. I am too, I am, I'm not uh, scared, but then um, I, I was scared too, but then I was scared too. <laughs> well, you don't want that shot. One time when I was a kid, I told the dentist, don't give me a shot. And he goes, all right. He starts drilling. I go, uh, give me the shot. <laughs> he goes, okay. Oh, Linda, whoops. I almost forgot. Say hi to Papa O for me. And then we all miss him too. Thank you. I will tell him that. Mar, you, uh, you just left the, the, you just left the shell Papa O lived in. Yeah, that's right. He's not there. And I, uh, you know, you just don't want to think about him down there. He's up here helping. He's running around all the kids' events. He's helping prepare for when Jesus comes back. And uh, he's very, very busy. And having the time of his life, he's very happy. I just feel his joy. And yes, you're right, Mar. <clears throat> And his soul is free from that shell. That's right. Sammy, do you remember when you started blogging? Do you remember on your 60th birthday? Do you remember the grandkids shouted? Yeah, you found that was surprised in 2000. Yeah, I remember that. Um, <clears throat> they um, surprised me for my 60th birthday. I, I'm impressed that you know that, Sammy. Uh, pretty exciting. Uh, it's weird to turn... <clears throat> 60 every time you turn that 50 the 60 the 70 the 80 it's it, you know it goes up a number and so it's kind of kind of a hard thing to accept like i'll be 69 in october and then in a year from then i'll be 70 but i don't worry about it because um it's just a number it's just an age and if you keep yourself healthy and and active you can just enjoy life like i want quality life and the years they add up whether you want them to or not but uh but you take care of yourself and you can enjoy and keep moving and uh you know with my real age being 51 you can just you don't have to age as quickly as you think 
And uh, Linda, Papa O is in the house doing things so you can fix them to keep you busy. Yeah, he's, he's doing, he's breaking stuff, <laughs> keeping me busy. And the, the cat's just sitting out here now. She was excited. See, she just sits out there. And I think when she comes in, it's to say hi to Papa O because he loved petting her. Sammy, and then you started crying when the uh, shock surprised. Yeah, I did. That That's awesome, Sammy, that you saw that. GTA, okay. Mar, you think it's it's weird to turn 60? Try turning 60. I know, when I hit the 70, and then the 80, and I think, oh, it's just a number. I always ask myself, if you didn't know how old you were, how old would you be? From Crocodile Dundee, <clears throat> he didn't know his age. And his girlfriend was asking, said, said, how old are you? He goes, don't know. Don't know how old I am. And Lainey, but you will really be 53. That's right. I'll really be 53 when I'm 70. Uh, Kay, Kay, uh, Kaylee, how are you? I'm doing good. Katie, Katie, I think is how you say that. Monica, welcome, Katie. Uh, uh, keep care of yourself and eat ice cream every day. That's right. Oh my goodness, Linda. In June, I will be 72. Wow. That's amazing. Sammy, by, uh, by it's been two years since my granddad died, and it's his birthday today. Wow. Happy birthday, um, Sammy's grandpa. Yeah, and they hang around. Where, where else would they be? Your ancestors are always helping you. They're, they're your angels. They're your guides. They're your... They're, helping you they warn you of things they suggest things to you they're they're there to help they want you to succeed and be happy and enjoy this life that they paved the way for so your ancestors are here they each generation gets gets uh life pretty nice i mean life's pretty nice right now i mean we have a lot of really niceties and and not to take those for granted and to just be busy helping people and service and be kind and nice and smile and even if you're having a bad day still smile you don't you don't have to wear your sadness on your face um because it won't make it better it won't make it go away and smiling helps it helps uh so that uh it doesn't seem so bad and uh Kaylee, Katie, if you can't say my nickname right, you can call me Kate, Caitlin. Yeah, I'm thinking Kate, because my granddaughter's name is, I have a Kaylee and a Catalina. And so you're very close with, their, your name's very close to theirs. Sammy, do you know Roseanne's middle name? Do you want me to tell you? Yeah, tell me if you know. It would be my maiden name. Kaylee, where are you from? I was born here in Utah, Highland, Utah. Mar, Linda, we are the same age. I'll be 72 in December. Wow, twinners. Monica, hello, Linda. May I ask you which June is your birthday? What day? You're right, Sammy. Roseanne Bueller Orgill. That's that's correct. Um, my parents didn't give us uh, give the girls middle names, so it was Roseanne Bueller, because when you get married, you take on the married name. But uh, we did the same with our daughters. We didn't give them middle names. Because uh, it could get a lot of names going on there. <laughs> but so fun to have you guys on here. It's getting close to when Davey's going to be here. I think we still have a few minutes. My timer has not gone off yet. I set a timer. Because I can see where Davey is traveling. And I know, know when he'll be here. And Linda, my birthday is June 26th. My dad's is June 25th. Wow. You're one day from my dad. My dad, mom and dad died in 2012. So they've been gone, what, 13 years? Something like that. You guys do the math for me. Mar, that's what I do. Use my maiden name as my middle name. Yeah, a lot of people do that. They, they don't have a middle name because it's their maiden name. And Katie, uh, I'm from Mississippi. I'll be 35 next month. Well, wow, Mississippi. I remember learning how to spell that. M-I-S-S-I-S-S-I-P-P-I -S 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 in school. We thought that was a fun uh, state to spell. Oh, let's see. That's a hard name. Rutupama. 
Where are you? Oh, I wonder if we're getting our trolls back. Well, I'm going to say my goodbyes. And thanks, everybody, for all your kind words and, and for helping me th uh, enjoy this live and enjoy uh, the time that you've been helped you helped me a lot when papa o died and and you're still helping me and i just really appreciate it and we're just gonna say our goodbyes and monica it's a good day my cousin's birthday is on the 27th linda i have my bio mom's first name francis really that's that's where frankie got his name francis is his name uh Ellie, you look 100. <laughs> Thanks, Ellie. <laughs> oh, you could tell. Let's see. Bye, Mama. Oh, bye, everyone. As soon as somebody says I look 100, the party's over. Mm. Yes. You could say something nice, you know. You don't have to say something mean. It's a choice. Goodbye, everyone. I love you all.